Okay, Karen. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to make sure the computer is unplugged and uh, then we're going to flip it over. What I want to have you do is uh, there's two pieces. I want the hinges furthest away from you, like I have here, and then the uh, rubbery side on towards you. And then there's four screws on the top here. I'll just point them out. One, two, three, four. There's one on the side and then three on the bottom. Now you notice that on the bottom ones, they're actually in into the keyboard or into the ba back of the case a little bit more. Um, so once you have this off, all you need to do is just take your fingernail or a very, very um, small, thin uh, flathead screwdriver and just kind of work it along the edges here on the top and on the sides. And as you're doing so, you're gonna be hinging it towards you like so. When you get to these final three screws on the bottom, it is going to be um, pretty challenging to get it off. You don't want to bend and break anything, but you uh, will have to apply some pressure. And you can see that it's because this bottom piece kind of lips around the bottom portion of the Lenovo. Once we have that off, we can set it aside. And the two connections that we're looking for are these two right here. They're right above the battery. And uh, let that focus for a second here. And what we need to do is we just need to make sure that we can toggle this little switch up like so. And if I then look at this connection, this is the keyboard connection. This could be loose in your machine. What we just need to do is make sure that that's pushed in there tight and then that this little switch goes down solid. And then we have to look at this connection as well because this is what actually does the function keys. So we can lift that up, see how that that cable just comes out and stuff it back in there. Flip that switch down. Put the case back on. And we want to snap all sides in. Put the screws in and then you're all set.